Hello, my name is Mata Sudaria Maria. I'm a student in the ninth grade at Vasily Alexandri National College in Yash. We'd like to present to you an activity we organized within the Kiko project, an Erasmus Plus European project. My name is Mihaela Manalake and uh, I'm a teacher of English at uh, Vasily Alexandri National College Yash. We are organizing an activity today within the project KeyCode implemented by uh, EuroEd. KeyCode is an Erasmus Plus uh, project and um, uh, the focus is on how feelings can uh, influence communication. Uh, today we are having an activity about the way in which feelings can influence our messages. Yes? I would like you to pair up because we will have a pair work activity. Yes? Uh, I invite you to fill in the blanks that we have here in the sentences that you'll see on the sheet. Thank you. As a teacher, um, I realized that many students have problems when uh, interpreting and um, um, realizing what other people feel when they convey a message. So our activity is named I am you. I invite you without asking your desk mate. Yes, to try to fill in the sentences that we have here. We want to consider profit, yes, for her or for him. So at this point, please don't ask any questions, yes? Just try to fill in the sentences here without asking him or her about the aspects here, yes? Okay. To exchange, yes? Your sheets of paper, yes? <laughs> Uh, and in pairs, please talk about what your desk mate has just written down about yourself, yes? And uh, what the reality actually is, yes? Okay, so uh, you'll have a few minutes to discuss, yes? I'm sure that uh, you'll have uh, fun, yes? While talking about... <laughs> I feel like my uh, benchmate has, uh, has hit the spot when it comes to, to the, the answers that she has given. Uh, she, has she has read more into the color I like than I, I did. I didn't know, um, I didn't know it gives me a vibe of confidence. I, found it I find it really funny to uh, see what other, others, other people think of us. Uh, I think my uh, deskmate actually uh, knows me better than even I do. I'm, I'm quite surprised uh, because Sandina knows me well and we have only met four months ago or five months ago. I'm surprised. <laughs> How did you feel, Alexandra, when you had to guess, to think of some aspects about uh, your deskmate. You are in uh, the ninth grade, so maybe you don't know each other very well. So, how did you feel? Um, I felt comfortable because uh, she is my uh, deskmate and uh, I am a very good friend of her and she's a very good friend of mine. And um, I found this activity very interesting, like I haven't done this before uh, in school and uh, it's a very special activity in my opinion, I like it. Like I said, I felt uh, 
pretty comfortable. My colleague here is a readable like a book, I'd say. It's pretty easy to write about him. And overall, I'd say it was a nice learning experience. Okay. These aspects important when we communicate, that is facial expressions, intonation. What do you think? Yuan, what is your opinion about these aspects that I mentioned? I think they're very important because you can see what the other people want to think about what we say and it's a great way to understand the feelings of them. Is empathy important? Delia? Yes, I think so. Okay. What about um, your feelings? Is the message everything? The message that we convey, is it everything when we communicate? Or are feelings also very important? Our feelings is also important. Okay. We learned a lot of interesting facts from this activity. We learned that the way we speak uh, represents a lot about the way we feel. For example, we speak in different ways when we are happy, sad, or angry, for instance. Does the same message can have different meanings? How we say something is as important as what we say. And I'm pretty sure we all enjoy this activity, and I'll definitely be more careful in the future with how I say my things. In the communication process, we all uh, are aware of the fact that empathy is paramount, is of uh, utmost importance, because uh, sometimes um, our feelings uh, are even um, stronger than, uh, than the message itself. And um, we are fully aware that uh, we need to, to share with, uh, with our students all of these aspects related to feelings and empathy within our classes. So um, the students were enthusiastic about this activity and um, um, they, um, they were um, involved and um, I think uh, it was a great opportunity for them to, to have this kind of activity. So all in all, um, it was a challenging and, um, and interesting activity.